Hello and welcome to today's video, featuring the all-new Project Cars 3. It's not always that you get to jump on the motion sim with a pro race driver. In this video, we have Tunku Jan Le and Natasha Siata, two professional Malaysian racers in a simulator with Project Cars 3. Let's introduce them. Uh, my name is Tunku Jan Le. Hi, my name is Natasha. I'm actually a female racing driver, a professional female racing driver. And I'm a professional racing driver. I first started back in 1995. So I'm actually a Malaysian Book of Records holder for being the first Formula racing driver in Malaysia. Well, the biggest accomplishment would be uh, two times champion for Formula Drift Asia that was back in 2009 and 2010 as well as a Brand Laureate Award winner for being the most successful racing driver in Asia. We also won the 12-hour uh, endurance race, uh, the Medeca Millennium Endurance Race 2005-2006. Ah, it's... Uh... I do, I do. So, um, I've been actually obsessed with the Porsche Carrera Cup cars. How you that car is insane. Honestly, I think I have a few different cars which I like. I, I guess cars have its own um, uh, character and depending on the different disciplines which you do, there is, you know, there is a car which I like for a certain activity. Mm -hmm. I have actually. We actually test on simulators. I have. Yes, I have. I actually enjoyed racing Project Cars 2. So my brother actually introduced me to it. Yeah, I had good fun on Project Cars 2 was awesome. Jan and Natasha have never played this game before and we'll be watching them flex their metal on the game using a Trustmaster TMX racing rig. We'll give them their impressions on the game. Go! So I'm driving the Toyota 86. It's not bad. The graphics are pretty good, I like it. This is so different <laughs> to actually driving. <laughs> oh no, they're all leaving me behind. Come on, come on. Oh, this is so good. <laughs> this is like a, a train of cars. Come on. Oh, come on. I'm sandwiched. I'm actually really enjoying it. The AI is, is a lot better. Actually quite different. Oh my god, I can't believe the AI did that to me. It feels almost realistic when you're actually driving, um, like when you're actually really racing itself. Uh, this is good fun. <laughs> out of my way, out of my way! And this is what happens. If you're touching the curb, if you go on the grass, you're most definitely going to spin. If you knock something, does your car have damage as well? <laughs> Too bad. So one thing you'd want to do is, engine block would be, yes, definitely, hands down, number one, because you want more power, right? Right, so we've actually upgraded the brakes, so brakes is going to help a lot when we're driving. Now it's a night race. This is cool too, I eh? got different, it does sound exactly like the actual car oh it's raining <laughs> it is <laughs> be gentle okay i will this is a really nice thing that you can actually hear your engineers it's actually very very nice that's cool that you've got a race spotter Ooh, you do feel the difference right, in the wet. Yeah, it's more, you've got to be really gentle with the throttle and brakes now. This is cool, this is so cool. Seriously. Yeah, I see. So the weather is so unpredictable that this actually literally happens in real life. <laughs> yeah. The dynamics of the car feels like the real car, so it's actually really, really loose and it's rear wheel drive. You know, one thing I realized about the nice thing about like project cars is that there are so many things that you can actually change from the car settings to even weather as well. 
and you know how unpredictable it is when you're actually driving on the real circuit. The first race which we had was dry and you could like gun it really hard but when it started to rain... So you sort of have to figure out how am I going to drive this? You have to be very gentle with it so it's, it's very similar to the real thing. So you've got to like balance it between the brakes and the throttle. So that's, that's great and it's a lot of fun actually. So far I like the feel of the actual getting used to sort of sim racing. Um, it's been a while since I've been sim racing. So far I re actually really like the graphics on the um, Project Cars 3. The one thing that I really like that I noticed that was very even like the small touches like the race engineering and it's good to have that back in. I think that a lot of sims uh, simulator type of uh, you know racing games they actually don't have this I think project cars is up there with amongst everyone else I'm, I'm really in this this is, feels almost real to me and even you know when you go from dry to wet you really feel the difference and although you don't have the full feedback back from the actual steering wheel itself I think this is a good way for for a lot of beginners to sort of understand what is racing you know the race laps qualifying practice Pretty good overall, yeah. I think it's fun. Um, it's great fun. So there's a lot more than just driving. There's a lot of games in there as well. And I think it's um, something which I would enjoy spending time driving and, and gaming with my son, for example. So sometimes you just got to take a break from racing, for example, and just have fun. And this is one of it. Um, I think there's a, there's a lot of things that you can do. Um, I heard, yeah, with Project Cars, now you can actually tune up your cars. So, yeah, you know, you've got the standard rims and tires and, you know, decals, patterns and all this. But what's really nice is that it gives you the feel of actually tuning up, you know, air intakes, um, your brakes, your tires. Um, even your engine blocks. You know, when you're actually driving on the circuit itself, you actually see a big improvement. Perfect. I think it's perfect for beginners uh, to understand. So it's a good platform to get into, um, to, to learn the basics before you move on to something more hardcore. Go out and get Project Cars 3 because it's a lot of fun. <laughs> In essence, Project Cars 3 is an easy to digest game that isn't your typical stoic racing simulator. Vastly unlike its predecessors, it grants players loads of freedom to pick and choose their playstyle and serves as a casual racing game with plenty of thrills and spills. A huge thanks to Bandai Namco Entertainment for making this video happen and our racers for being such good sports. There you go guys, hit that subscribe and like button, comment your thoughts on Project Cars 3 and as always, thanks for watching.